This is Anderson Penn's podcast, episode 408 for Wednesday, September 15th, 2021. This is Brian. This is Lisa. Good morning. Good morning. So we had a customer come in the store the other day. Well, I would hope so. Well, yes. <laughs> nice guy. Nice guy. Stayed for a while, looked at some pens, inks, paper, stuff like that. His name was Gravity. He was real down to earth. Real attractive guy, too. <laughs> um, this is my last podcast for a while. For a while, yes. Not last podcast, last podcast for, for a while. For me. Yes. For a while. Because... I'm going to Chicago. Um, we are opening the reopening the Chicago store next week. And so uh, I leave, we leave on Sunday to go down to get everything ready. Um, we have ordered what felt like millions of dollars worth of product and hopefully it arrives next week. Um, <laughs> please just uh, bear with us while we work to restock. And um, it'll be interesting to be back and uh, it'll be interesting to actually go to work every day. Yes. I've been working from home for the last 18 months. Yeah, you get up and you move like six feet. It's like 10. Nope. <laughs> I get up, I get dressed. At least I'm not in my pajamas. <clears throat> like, no, you, you do. Know, you a do. lot of yeah. people at home who are working from home um, and are getting ready to go back to their jobs, even part time. It's like, oh my God, I have to like yeah. wear pants for all those Zoom calls. You're not wearing <laughs> pants. And, you know, so um, I had to rethink my shoes. We always work better at home if you're dressed. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know, with shoes, including shoes. Absolutely. So. Makes right. you feel like you're more ready for the day. But it'll be um, a little bit odd uh, to go back and be not in my home office. Right every day. And so when are we opening? When's, we the, opening when's the unofficial, the, is there an unofficial and an official date? No, it's all just, it's, it's on the website, kind of. it's all on official. <laughs> uh, sub Monday, September 20th, uh, we will be open Monday through Saturday, from then on, 9.30 to 5.30. And on Sundays, uh, right now we're gonna do noon to four. Uh, we'll look at expanding the hours down the road, but for now, no. um, <clears throat> those are gonna be the hours. Great, great. So, and then I can duck out on Sundays at four o'clock and go to the Art Institute for a couple hours. And you better because I, I know I bought you that that membership, membership for your birthday. You renewed my membership. I'm very excited. So that'll be fun. We've been uh, putting a lot of ink in there. You've been going out about once every ten days. Once or so. every ten days uh, to drop things off and uh, pens are, have been going in mm -hmm. and uh, uh, it, it's starting to shape up pretty nice. Hogonichi. Yes. So <laughs> I can't believe you took one. I, I did take one. Um, you better use it. I, I am going to use it. I have plans. <laughs> I, I'm already. I'm already looking at. Well, uh, uh, like like many people, uh, COVID was not kind to my waistline. So I am planning oh, on using wow. that. You went there. Well, I. You know. I mean. Wow. I went there. So I plan on. That's one of the things I plan on using. I was tracking okay. uh, activity and uh, um, and things like that. So. Um, See, I wasn't going to say that I'm going to put my weight in there and hopefully watch it go down to where it needs to be. Well, that, you know, yeah. if you got to write it down every day, then... Then you see it then and you it holds you every accountable. Day. Yeah. All right. So anyway, yes, I did get one, but I brought some, some Hobonichi in uh, that are still left. So we are out of, uh, just FYI, we are out of the Techo A6 and the Cousin A5 for now. The plain, no cover, just the planner. Correct, correct. Okay. Uh, we will have a second order period coming up, uh, I believe next month. Okay. Uh, details to follow, but we do have a good selection of uh, Techo, Cousin, and Weeks uh, covers available, so I brought some in. Cool. And uh, where do you want to start? You know, last year, uh, was it last year? Two years ago, there was a cover set that I loved. And we actually had it for a lot longer than I thought. And I would I would touch it and pet it and drool over it. And um, <laughs> it ended up in Chicago. It was beautiful. It was it nice. It ended up Very in nice. Chicago. Yep. It was last year. And um, I almost kept it for myself. And then um, we had a customer... Uh, from overseas come in yes, and she bought it. And I'm glad that it went to a good home. 
but this is in the same vein. This one's cute. I like this one better. The other one had had a little bee. Bumblebee, a which, bumblebee was adorable, it, which was adorable. And it was more in shades of blue. This one is the reflect, but the best, and, and it's really pretty. It's kind of a tweed fabric, but the best part is the closure has a little cat looking in a mirror. It's adorable. The cutest it's thing. Adorable. Just adorable. Um, so. But um, yeah, so I almost kept a techo, and I'm glad I didn't because I wouldn't have used it. But um, the leather, this lilac leather, this is, is pretty. This is a nice. Really, it's kind of a, a gray, purplish gray. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Super really, really pretty. pretty. Um, and if you like leather, this is nice. It's attractive. It's very nice. You have one. I, I don't have a cousin. You don't need a what cousin. What is it about Hobonichi that makes me want to get like four oh, like of them? That Outside one. pocket, yep. Uh, and then here we've got, this is the uh, the cover, the cover only. Oh, I love these. Um, this is the mother. So the video game, and it actually comes with the- Oh, that's so cute. A little metal like a card, little. yeah. Uh, but it's adorable. It's got, you know, all your characters and stuff on the outside. And you know, I um, took one of the uh, cover only last year and I use it as my wallet. You've got a zipper, you've got all sorts of little pouches in here. And then um, it did really make me cut back on what I carry in my wallet. Um, yeah, it's a, it's which a really was tough. But no, really cute. It's a really cool, cool design. There's, there's a lot going on there. So we've got uh, some cool, <coughs> excuse me, Techo covers sets. Now, the sets do come with a Techo in there. So you're not just paying for the cover, you're paying yep. for the actual planner as well, just so we've made people make sure you understand what you're getting. Um, this year I opted for a week's and um, we still have some plain colors left. Um, this one is just adorable. Oh, soy. Um, and then there's uh, the dog and the pussy cat. Yeah, and then I, I flip it around, you can see the little, little guy in the back. It's oh, just, so it's just adorable. <clears throat> and then, uh, shall we have some tea? I almost took this one. Just because it was bright and yep. springy it's and cheerful. happy. Yep. Ladies in pretty dresses. I just thought that was nice. Eiffel Tower, little dog um, on there. I decided I was gonna do a little crafty project. And so I finished yesterday. Okay. I took a week, so I have the black line, uh, the white white lines black. But yeah. I made a cover for it. I have the, uh, the clear cover. And then I took a piece of, um, I got a couple, so I have options. Um, I took some paper, uh, scrapbook paper from one of the craft stores. And this one reminds me <clears throat> of my grandmother's Danish china. Yeah, it's pretty. Um, but I The can, white and blue. Yeah, I can switch it up. So I'm kind of excited about that. And so that. What, what, what size do these end up being? Is these this end up being actually just, a, they're not <clears throat> quite square. They're about, just about eight inches by seven and a half. Okay. Um, what I did was I laid out the weeks and kind of rolled it over on the paper and measured it. And then I cut scrap paper just to try as a template. And it turns out that there's just a tiny bit more room inside the cover, mm, which okay. makes so sense. So it extends over a little yeah. bit, yeah. So I had to make it a little bit bigger and, and play with okay. it, but it's right around eight by seven and a half. Yeah, you could have a lot of fun with that actually, you know. Well, I don't want to go <clears throat> too crazy, but yeah. I did opt for two other, this one reminds me a lot of my wallet. Yes, yes, yeah, it um, does. And then just plain blue. You could stick if it just... inside your Liberty fabric. Well, yeah, I could, but then it would be really bulky. So anyway, that's my big craft project for the week. Awesome. Um, but it was super easy. So we've got uh, a good selection of Hobonichi yes. left. Um, and if there's something that's out that you're interested in, please do sign up for the back of stock notifications because when we can order again, uh, we'll take that into account for what, yes. what we order. But just because you did put in a back in stock doesn't mean that we can get it. Yeah, they we'll see. They could be out right. completely at Hobonichi when it's time to reorder. Um, so definitely fill that out. I started telling people about the benefits of dried grapes. It's all about raisin awareness. September, the month of September, mm -hmm. is the Sailor Don't Miss the Boat promotion. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, a ever Rare. Since, it's 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 the only time this has ever happened since we've been a dealer. I think so. It's the only time. Um, Sailor has very strict pricing policies, and if you want to remain an authorized retailer, you follow those. <laughs> um. So 
So uh, now there's a, the discontinued, mm -hmm. so retired uh, pens, retired colors. Oh, I like that. Are retired. now eligible for forty percent discount, which so, is crazy <clears throat> good. We have we were able to get uh, a few more in. So what is available is key lime, and we discovered Pro Gear Slim in blueberry. So, which is a killer, killer color. That's a fun kind very, of a color. Very, very nice blue color. color. Those, uh, the blueberries are on their way, but uh, those are the only two pens that are eligible for that 40% discount. And we do because have. Because we've sold out of everything, everything else, is else and Fresca the warehouse is, is gone. Fresca is gone. There's no more available to buy. Okay. Um, and uh, the ringless Epinard is gone. And uh, so, uh, but key lime large and standard. Okay. The 21 karat and the 14 karat nib. And the Pro Gear Slim, Slim Blueberry, uh, and and some of those pens will ship a little bit later. So okay. uh, they they should be coming in this week. So it might be a couple days. Great. Um, before they ship, but the Blueberry, can you believe that? I couldn't believe it. <sighs> you know, we I had think... actually we thought they were gone. Yes. We'd actually deleted them from the website yes. months ago, and you they know, found some. It's just a neat color, really, yes. really a super and cool color. And the Pro Gear Slim is my and favorite. It's model in the sailor lineup and it's stupid cheap it's stupid cheap um it's ridiculous i could i could get one at a good price you could uh, i know somebody so anyway those are the only 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 three pens essentially yes uh but we're still available through the rest of the month yes while so. supplies <clears throat> last while supplies last okay okay we're going to talk about this speaking of while supplies last we're going to talk about this just so people know okay they came in and they went out okay uh is our last one or is this yours this is this is mine this is the Pilot Limited Edition Vanishing Point, the black ice for this year. You know, I almost feel like it was anticlimactic. <clears throat> we Yeah, you know, last year came around Hobonichi, too. And okay. Um, really cool. I'm, I'm liking the ombre that they do. Mm -hmm. um, I think maybe it's time to move on from that. Like, you can only yeah. use so many ombres, although yeah, green would be kind of cool. Green would be neat, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I saw this and I said, you know what? I, I applied the Lisa theory. How much am I going to complain about it if I don't get one? And, and the, the number was high. <laughs> it was, I, I just couldn't see it. I, I couldn't okay. do it when I saw it in person because it actually has a, a higher gloss finish on it, which is really super cool. Okay. Um, and in that nice, pretty blue, it's 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 super cool. But it so, came in and like went out. We we got a very tiny allocation. This so year. you thought that you were going to whine more than I was going to yell. I always ask for forgiveness rather than permission. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> no, it's cool. That and always works. I know. And you know, I was looking in the pen case of pens that I'm going to take to Chicago, and. Um, I have a number of vanishing points that I'm taking. They're they're super super handy. Oh yeah, I, mean, I know, love mine. I love my decimal. So I like the finger um, pens. But uh, I thought we should mention it. We did we, have we have them. some. We sent out the notices, and uh, the pen is sold out. And I, I don't believe we can get any more. No. So okay. I've asked, and I've not heard anything. So okay, uh, there are none none left to be had. But I wanted to mention we had it, so people aren't waiting for it. So. Okay. The new uh, three V. Go ahead. 580 ALR Navy. Navy. Um, I was in the store the other day and I held, you know, we have them out on display next to the Prussian blue. And the Prussian blue is definitely more teal. Yeah, yeah. This is um, definitely. I, I would say this is Navy. Yeah. It is definitely a dark blue. Um, definitely not teal. There's no purple in it. But it's, it's a pretty color. It's not so dark that you're not quite sure if it's black or navy. Yeah, it's a neat color. I, I'm, I'm, I, I'm just a big fan of the Prussian blue, so yeah. um, to me, I, I wasn't, this just wouldn't be one for me, but it is a nice color. I yeah. mean, it's it's really attractive. And in the ALR, I like the ribbing uh, on the top of the cap and, and on the section, it's really, really super cool. Twisby does a great job. So these are nice pants. And I like the weight too of the, the ALs. Okay. So anyway, those are available. Um, Coming soon. Yes. Uh, a new Penlux. So for those of you who are big fans of the, the Penlux uh, Masterpiece Grande, which is a, a big chunker of a pen. Yes, it is. Um, it's actually 149. It's king of pen size with the piston filler, steel Yovo nib. New color coming out soon. Yeah. Red and black Koi. The Koi. I like the Kois. The Kois are just so Do nice. Have I don't have one. Uh, the blue. <laughs> Man. 
<laughs> I, I, I like Koi. So, um, but they're nice. They're big. If you, if you like a p bigger pen or you need a bigger pen, uh, these guys are great. And the price is very reasonable for what you're getting. It's not um, for oversized piston filler. It's right. crazy, you know. No, it truly is. Under 200 And there are bucks, some really, know. really pretty colors. In fact, um, I moved some down to Chicago the other day, and mm -hmm. I was laying them out. I'm like, this is yeah. kind of pretty. Yeah, you'll have a full compliment down there, by the way. So. Awesome. Um, but the red and black koi uh, coming soon. Uh, really, really nice, nice looking pen. So. Great. Um, also, Y Studio uh, coming out soon, and I know they've been uh, posting images. It should be this month, I believe. New classic fountain pens. Cool. So these are going to come in some really nice colors, or the green, red, blue. Mm -hmm. um, nice, nice weight. Yep. Yeah. Um, if you like a heavier pen, these are nice. They're very attractive, uh, very classic. I like the green. Um, the green, green, looks, green cool. looks nice. And yeah. the blue looks cool. And green's not usually a popular. I don't know why it's not a popular font. This color. is a good dark green, yeah. though. You yeah. know, forest you've, green. You've re yes. It's not. It's not like the the, the Lamy. Uh, new green that came out. No, that was the old mm -hmm. apple green. So, but anyway, Y Studio uh, classic fountain pens uh, coming soon. You can check those out on the website. See what yes. they're, they're all about. Cool. Uh, reminder. Okay. For folks. Um, oh, let me look at this. I need <clears> another pen case. I, you have one of these, don't you? I gave you one of these. I don't think Sailor so. pen cases. We have ten. These are ten pen leather cases. They have the Sailor. Logo embossed on the front, which is cool. Um, which is super cool. These are big. Yeah. So this is gonna hold. Give me a pen. I, well, that's a. Oh, that was easy. That's a Miki, but um, <laughs> they have a nice wide slot. So what these are is these are cases that came with our cocktail sets. Yes. And so, we broke up the cocktail sets. So we have and these nice have cases. These cases left over. Um, but they're the, the the what we're doing is is we're not selling them as new because well they have. Would you stop playing here? No, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to see from, what fits. From, from from moving the pens in and out, and they were in plastic sleeves. Um, you know, there's 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 a couple of marks on the inside. Tiny but little evidence that they have been used very 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 lightly once. Yeah. Um, well, and this makes twice, but. Um, I like that they've got the big long piece of elastic. Mm -hmm. I hate it when there's just a tiny little piece and then the yeah they won't they won't the, they won't wiggle no, around. That's no. that's the nice thing. Or yeah. you know so anyway these are uh, we're selling these as is. Uh, they're fifty percent off the retail. They're very nice. So if you have a nice sailor collection, um, you know you've got the little sailor on the anchor logo, um, little Popeye thing going on. I have a nice uh, sailor collection. You do, and it's a nice, <laughs> it's a nice nice soft black leather. Uh, yeah. It's really well, really, really well done. Um, while they last, we did have somebody ask the other day, I should address, there is nothing on these cases that mention cocktail. Okay. So the, these are just a black yeah, sailor pen case. It's an actual standard case that we could get if we wanted to. Um, so it doesn't say cocktail on it. Okay. It's not an anniversary case or anything like that. So okay. what else? Is there anything else you would like to say? Your last podcast parting words i'll be back well <laughs> <laughs> uh come see us in chicago come see me in chicago um we're gonna go down on sunday um and then cole's a london event yes cole's a london event and michael's gonna special be special guest yep I'm michael excited. John, john lane you know i love john we've been good good friends for yep. many years now but I, I will confess publicly, and I know that they listen to this, I was a little disappointed that I, I, Michael is working on bigger, he's got bigger fish to fry. But I used to deal directly with Michael, and we had a good, we still have a good relationship. I was a little sad that he had kind of passed us off to John. And I mean, we couldn't be in better hands, well, yes, but yes. so I'm excited to be able to see Michael again. Um, he's just so much fun. John's going to be watching this go, what is she talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not upset we have John, but I just was. But we get both. We get I both know, for the event. So Michael is going to be there. Michael Hujara, as well as John Lane. That is the best possible scenario. So if people don't know who these people are, what are they going to be showing? Uh, Visconti and St. <laughs> Dupont. And it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be cool. So um, I will I will be coming down for that. Yes. Um, I am skipping. Well, the show. Wait, you're not gonna leave me unsupervised with two handsome men with a no, whole bunch no, of cool no, pens. No, no. 
because that's um, really great. I am I am skipping the Chicago Pen Show this year, uh, but I will come down to the store uh, for the Coles of London event, which is the first Monday uh, after the Chicago Pen Show. So in October. In October. Yes. So. Um, more details to follow, but... Well, and we will not be a vendor at the Chicago Pen yeah, Show. Yeah, I'm not. Um, because I'll be in Chicago and Brian can't do all that by himself. And Brian is not going to... I'm Brian's not decided not <clears throat> to attend as an attendee. No, that'll be the first one I've missed in 20... It's just years. too close to the opening of the store. And, it, yeah, and there, there's the a lot of black and, going on, so... Yeah. But so. Uh, anyway, uh, Cole's London events... Super excited. Uh, in, in a couple of weeks. So that yes, will be John, fun. John, we love you. <laughs> so we'll, we'll have more details with the hours uh, coming soon. Yes. So I believe we're going to start at noon. We usually around start, noon-ish. We usually start the events around noon-ish. Yes. That gives everybody time to, to get in and, and settle. So. Absolutely. Uh, anything else? I'm trying to think. Deep thoughts? I know. No, I think we've covered everything. Um, you are going to take a pause from podcasts for a little bit yeah you know if i can uh, if i can uh, uh, ha- uh <laughs> lasso if i can thank you <laughs> if i can hassle if i can lasso somebody uh into into sitting in your seat um, justin. maybe we'll have justin do it he's not a he's, he's not, not he, so, he wants no part of that. we uh, we will see we will uh I, i'm sure we will come up with something and, and uh, we'll find a willing participant when i come back I'll do a you'll, podcast you'll with somebody. Maybe Justin will do a podcast with me. Maybe. That'd be fun. <laughs> so anyway. <laughs> I'll tell the uh, joke. <laughs> come see her in Chicago. Absolutely. And I will be in Appleton. And I think that's it. I think that's so, it. So thanks for joining us. Tune in next time for more talk about pens, ink, and paper. Follow our blog for news, um, reviews, and upcoming events. And uh, check us out on social media as Anderson Pens. Uh, check me out at our store in Chicago, which opens on September 20th. Ground floor of the Palmer House Hilton. Yes. Opens seven days a week. Website is chicago.andersonpens.com. Like this video and subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you next time. I saw a microbiologist today. He was much bigger than I expected. Yeah, yeah, yeah.